Hey, what's up guys? This is John McLennan here, and uh, we're doing another lesson this week on Big Green Tractor. Um, this is a great acoustic song. Um, you can get a lot of really good open sounding voicings. Um, so I hope this lesson is going to be helpful for you. Um, if you haven't gotten the PDF yet, basically just a chart to uh, show you the chord changes and stuff, um, you can get that in the more info. And uh, once you get that in your email, then you can print it out. And uh, I think it'll be really uh, bring a lot of clarity to kind of this lesson. So uh, be sure to do that. Now, uh, only just a couple chords. The song's in the key of E. And uh, I'm referencing the chart over here on, on another computer laptop. So um, I'm just going to look at the top. We have an intro, and we start off on E for one bar. And then we go to B sus. F sharp minor, E over G. Now this chord's a little tricky because basically you have your normal E shape, which will work, but if you really want to make it sound cool, just play the top four strings. I think that's a nicer voicing. And then we're going to go to A2. So basically with those chords together, you get this. Now that E over G sharp comes real quick on the and of four, so it's uh, the measure starting on the F sharp minor would be like one, two, three, four, and, and then go to the A. So if you're not familiar with these chords, again, they're uh, notated out in the, in the uh, PDF. So uh, that's basically your intro. We're holding that whole note on A, and then we're going to the verse. So uh, again, we have E. You can stay on the E for two bars. If you want to get this other chord, it's a little bit more complicated. E over D sharp. And how this works is basically, if you're playing E, say, up here at the seventh fret, then you move your first finger down one string, and then your pinky can go on the, uh, on the fourth string, ninth fret, and then your third finger goes on the th third string, eighth fret. So that chord is... So we have this kind of thing. Go to C sharp minor, two beats on each. So it's like, and then here comes the chorus. So that's just like the intro, except for um, in the fourth bar of the chorus, so if you count over one, two, three, four, um, instead of just playing that A, we're going to go A, A, and then back to E. So, and then the last time would just be a whole note on A, two, three, four. And then we have this little kind of re-intro thing, which just goes... back to the verse again. So everything goes over again, typical kind of pop song form where you hit the verse again and then the chorus. Um, <clears throat> now the only other part here is the bridge. And this is going to go like this. We have C sharp minor for one bar, then to A. So it's like... Then C sharp minor. B. Two, three, chorus. Cool. So um, hopefully that uh, brings basically a bunch of clarity to that. And again, get the PDF. I think it'll help a lot. And uh, we'll talk to you soon. Have a great week.